Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to download and install HP Dixit 2131 printer driver in a Windows 10 PC or laptop. It is a very easy and simple process. So let's go to our video. First, we check our machine is 32 bit or 64 bit. That is very easy. Go to the, this PC, right click on this PC. Here we find properties, click on the properties. In properties, I minimize it. In properties, if you find system type, in system type, if you find 32 bit, then that machine is 32 bit operating system machine. If you find 64 bit, then that machine is 64 bit operating system machine. This machine is 64 bit operating system machine. Close it. After that, go to the any web browser that you like. I'm going to the Google Chrome. In Google Chrome, I type HP Dixit. 2131 printer driver and hit enter key on your keyboard. First link is from the support.hp.com. It is an official website of the HP printer. Open the first link. Here is the HP website. Here is the our printer name and here is the our operating system. It is detect our operating system Windows 10 and 64 bit. It is right. But in any case, your operating system or bit is not right. Then go to the choose a different OS. Here select your operating system in version, select version. In my case, Windows 10 64 bit, go to the Windows 10 64 bit. If Windows 10 32 bit, then go to the Windows 10 32 bit and click on update. And it's refreshed this box or this all drivers. And after that, go to the scroll down. And in here, at last, we find installation software and full basic driver supports print and scan functionality only. Expand this. Here we find one driver name HP Dixjet 2130 series. This is an this series printer. This is an 2130 series printer and our printer name is HP Dixjet 2131. This is the our drivers. Here is the our driver file size and here we find download button. Click on this download button. It's redirect to another page and our download start at the top. It is a very big file. Not a very big but, but big. Big file. It's take few minutes, so be a patient and wait for a few minutes or few seconds. Our download is completed. Go to the downloads. Here we find show in a folder. Click on show in a folder. Minimize the our website. Drag this file, drag, drag this setup file to desktop. Close it. And here is the our drivers. And we are going to extract this zip file. This setup file is actually a zip file. Right click on it. Here we find extract files. Click on the extract files. Click on OK. It's extract our GIF file or the setup file to our desktop. It's take few minutes or few seconds. So be a patient. Here we find our folder. Double click on it. And here we find our all drivers. There are two ways to install this printer. First way is go to the here setup. Find setup. Double click on the setup and install your printer driver. And another way is also very simple. We go to the another way. This is our first way. Double click on the setup and set up your files. Another way is very simple. Close it. I show you. Go to the start and type printers and scanners. Click on the printers and scanners. In printers and scanner at the top, we find add a printer or scanner. Click on add a printer or scanner. It's refreshed and in few seconds, new options are available or appear on our screen. New option is the printer that I want isn't listed. Click on that. Scroll down. Minimize this window. Here we find add a printer. In add a printer, select last option. Add a local printer or network printer with manual settings. Select the last option. Click on the next. Here we find port. Port is the most IMP part in this installation. Go to the here. And if you find HP printer, HP printer device dot four underscore zero zero one HP printer device, anything about HP, then select that. If you not find HP port, the next option is USB. Select any USB that you find. USB zero zero one, zero zero two, zero zero three, zero zero four. Select any USB that you find. Click on the next. Here, click on the have a disk. Click on the browse. Go to the desktop. Here is the our folder. Double click on our folder. Here we find our all drivers from here to here. This is all our drivers. Select any drivers that you want. I select the first driver. Click on the open. Click on the OK. Here is the, our HP Dixjet 2130 series printer or the our printer is in this series printer driver. Select that. Click on the next. You can give any name that you like. Our printer name is 2131. So I just give a 2131 HP Dixjet 2131. 
and click on the next. It's installing our printer and it's take few minutes or few seconds, few seconds. So be a patient and wait for a few seconds. Here we find two options, share this printer. If you want to share this printer, select this, share this printer with the network. I don't want to share this printer with the network on our other computers. So I go to the here, do not share this printer and click on the next. If you want to print a text page, then click on a printed text page or click on the finish. After that, we just go to the our start button and restart our machine. Restart our machine is very IMP in this installation process. Go to the start power button and restart our machine. After machine is restart, we are going to check our printer is properly installed or not. That is very easy. Go to the start, type printers and scanners. Click on the printers and scanners. In printers and scanners, if you find your printer name HP, HP Dixjet 2131, that means that printer is properly installed in Windows 10 PC or laptop. So guys, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you guys.